Ramirez has to know, we, fans didn't pay to just see him push his opponent away. He's got to engage and try to get some jujitsu going. Uh, so here we go, let's see. And now oh. he's backing up and away from the guard. This is, this isn't good. Yeah, a little bit bizarre from Paul Harris. The referee is saying you've got to engage. Because they were already on the ground. That, that's so. it. He can't, he can't just keep backing away. Craig Jones! I want to get too risky, but I mean, it's hard to engage someone with uh, such a strength, a strength advantage. It just keeps framing. Very frustrated. It looked like the Brendan Schaub approach. AJ is going to have to get Gilbert to really expend a lot of energy early on, and I think that's exactly why he's trying to talk to him and get him emotional trying to get him to do things he normally doesn't do. Yeah, we saw a similar game plan from Wagner Rocha earlier when he took on Mateus Lucis, and that definitely seemed to pay dividends later on in the match. A lot more time. The replay, we can see this here. Yeah. Yeah, that's and a Wagner wrist. Rocha has scored a wrist lock. That is not well, my goodness. Time. Wow. At the Kasai Pro 1 tournament. I don't think we're going to see Wagner Rocha try anything else other than keeping him pressed away here. If there's, ooh, now this is interesting. Two of the refs have called stalling on Wagner Rocha. And that's going to be one point to Hanato Canuto, and it's going to tie it up. And with 33, with the second, the second penalty. Oh wow! 20 seconds left. Hanato Canuto is going to be gifted this one. I must admit, I missed that. That was a second. And I'm not sure Wagner knows that. I, yeah. I'm not sure he's aware that he's down right now. He, maybe he doesn't. Because I don't, I don't, I'm not sure his corner realizes that either. I thought it was winning until I looked over at the end of the match. I'm like, what the fuck? Lost. Like, that, you know, excuse my language, yeah. But I thought I was winning, you Johnny D's first experience at Wawa. What do you think? There was literally nothing in here that is edible. <laughs>